now you're back in online mode, you should preview your report before you submit it off. This is where you can see if you've made any mistakes or added in any incorrect photos. So you just hit the preview report button, click preview, and then you can see a preview of your report. So you just have a look through, have a look at the compliance questions you've answered, have a look at the three, any 360 photos and any descriptions you've populated in your report. If you have realized you've made a mistake, you just go back, hit back again, then go to the room and space you want to edit. So if I've made a mistake in the dining room, click in dining room, find the relevant item, and then make any tweets or any edits. And that will update your report live. Once you've then previewed your report, you're then able to submit your report. So you just go back to the relevant section, find your report, and then at the bottom, it will say submit to report. Hit the submit button, and then your tenant will get an email of their report where they're able to provide feedback on your checking report. The paperless process has now kicked in and you can manage the rest from your desktop site. When the report has been completed, you'll notice the report goes green on your account. So in this case, the tenant has provided some feedback and you've agreed to their comments and that's all audit trailed in the report. If you wish to share that report via PDF or via link, you can do that in a number of ways. So you can click on the cog, click download report. You can download a PDF copy as a recommended version, or you can customize it and show additional full page photos of the photos you've taken in the report. You can also remove the tenant's details as well and any personal details in case you need to share that with an external party. If you wish to share that report via a link, you just click on the cog, click share report, and then you can generate a link, which you can then share via WhatsApp or over email. You can also email the report directly to whoever you want as well. By clicking the cog, click email report and typing in their name and email address and clicking send. And it's as easy as that.